I'm very concerned at the, the way in which some school building contracts, but this would apply to any contract, but I have responsibility for the school building contracts, uh, have resulted in subcontractors who have done work for which they have not been paid uh, and that in some way or other that uh, they are at a loss and that their workers are not being properly paid. In fact, I've had some discussions uh, within the department about how best we can ensure that these things don't happen. Well, in the, the people who lose out in the first instance are the people who have worked and for which they've put their own money into as subcontractors and have not got paid. That, that should not happen in my view. And I say that as a former professional architect. Uh, the school's building programme is, is, is an enormous building programme. It's 1,500 million over the next uh, five years. And we want to make sure that not only do we get the buildings that we need from an educational point of view, but that those who work in providing those buildings uh, are properly treated and properly paid.